Welcome! It's Animal Crossing! Bitch! Hey Jackie! I'm streaming! Fuck. Fucking bitch, dude. I swear to God. I... You know what? Hey, welcome! It's, uh... It's the time of the month. Or year. Hold on. It's the time of the year, baby. This, we got the scares. And we got the pumpkins. We got the um fucking hold on. I I forgot to turn off my my air my fan. Give me a second here. <laughs> but it's fucking scary. I'm fucking terrified, okay? I'm horrified. Uh. Ah! I just dumped like half my fucking Red Bull onto the floor, damn it. I hate it here. <laughs> Off to a great start. Ugh. Fuck you! Fuck everybody! <laughs> Did I end up beating the furry game? No, it crashed, and then when I tried to load the save, it wouldn't, uh, load. So I, I... Gave up because fuck that. I wasn't gonna play through that whole thing again. Um. So, Animal Crossing. I was gonna do some. Oh fuck yeah, Lucky's wearing a Joy Division shirt. Um. Uh. Oh, well, that's just too fucking bad. I bet my Red Bull. <sighs> so. Um, let me just, uh, hold on. There we go. Um, so, Animal Crossing. I'm gonna do some, uh, hanging out in Animal Crossing for a bit. Um, I still have stuff to give away, and I was thinking, um, uh, I was just gonna get rid of it, uh, off stream or whatever, but it's a great gimmick to get people to follow me from Reddit and stuff. So, um, I might give away some more stuff, and then, uh, I'm gonna try to keep the Animal Crossing stuff a little bit short today, because, um, I also want to play some, uh, kitty horror show games. I'm, uh, debating if I want to do Anatomy or, uh, Haunted Cities 4. Um, we'll see which one, but then after that, because this is a fucking scary month, and I'm scared to fucking death, I'm losing my mind, I'm gonna do some Silent Hill 2. Uh, because Silent Hill 2 is one of my all-time favorite games. Um, I have a lot to say about it. It's, uh, greatly influential to me in, like, my music, and also in terms of just, like, I don't know, how I approach media. Things like that, and, I don't know. I just think it'd be a fun thing for me to stream in case, you know, you've never played it. Um, though I strongly recommend, um, if you've never played it, find a copy of it or just emulate it. And, uh, play it for yourself alone and just kind of experience it because it's a fantastic game. Um, but I'm going to be streaming that later tonight. Um, it's a pretty short game, so I think I'll probably be able to knock it out in like two streams if all goes well. I used to be able to beat it in like an hour and a half or two hours. Um, so, yeah, so that's that's kind of what we got on the menu for tonight, I think. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to hop in, and uh, I think it's about time for to cross these animals, boys. I just thought I'd uh, fuck around and do some, like, uh, Halloween decorating. And also, um... Ah, oh, damn it, I forgot to... I forgot to fucking make the Reddit post again. Son of a bitch. 
Uh, okay, let me... Over here on, uh... Yeah. But yeah, um... So yeah, I'll just, I just figured we just relax, do some uh, Halloween decorating, and kind of get ourselves warmed up for the day. Um, right now on David Byrne, it's uh, 6.41 p.m. on Tuesday, October 5th, 2021. So, uh, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, 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 that's it. What? Oh, what? You expected more? No. Sorry. Uh, yeah. So, uh... Yeah, I might do another giveaway stream, um, uh, maybe on Saturday. Oh, also, I'm house- uh, I was gonna stream this Saturday, but I'm currently house-sitting again for my mom, and so I can't stream when I'm over there. So, uh, sorry about that, but, um, I'm thinking this Saturday I will try to make it back up here before work, and I will do another, um, giveaway stream on Animal Crossing. Uh, and then after that, I'm just gonna get rid of all the stuff. Um, I would have just gotten rid of it, but it, I don't know, pulled in some viewers. And, uh, so, I, I don't know, I figured I'd want to at least take advantage of that. Um, but, okay. Uh, on behalf of all of us here at Jolly Red's Treasure Trawler, I'd like to thank you for your wise, and if I may add, a final purchase of a glowing painting. No refunds, Red owner present. Every fucking time Red has showed up in my goddamn game, uh, he has given me these same fucking paintings. It is garbage, and I hate it, and I hate him. Uh, you know, question for you, Sean. Uh, you know the way the sun goes away and everything gets real dark and boring? Well, how about if everything didn't need to get real dark and boring? Think about it. Fuck. What's in my pockets? Oh, is it pumpkins? Oh, it's a bunch of bugs and shit. Um, so yeah, I figured, um, first off, I'm gonna, um, kind of go around and start, to fucking doing the Halloween decorations, you know? I've been collecting pumpkins pretty much since, uh, last year, which, um, and also trying to collect, like, pine cones and acorns and stuff, because I missed, like, all of that last year, um, Uh, these are just some random bugs. Um, whoops. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, that furry game was kind of fun. Um, I had fun with it. I'm kind of looking forward to making, um, a video out of it. Uh, but, yeah, I wasn't going to go through and beat the rest of it. And I'm definitely, though, like, gonna be doing more games like that. Like, so I'm thinking for, like, an upcoming stream maybe next week, I will try and do, like, um, go through some, like, uh, DOS, like, horror point and clicks and stuff. I want to do, I want to be festive. It's the spooky month to be scared. Um, I hope everyone watching has a panic attack and shits and farts and cums in their pants. Um... Because, uh, that's, it's the, tis the fucking season, baby. Tis the fucking season. How many of mom's tea cozies do I have at this point? So, yeah, I figured, um, you know, I, even, I kind of only wanted to play Animal Crossing for like an hour and a half, so I might, um, just not, um, do the giveaway stuff today and just kind of focus on, we'll just leave this garbage where it is. Um... And I'm thinking of swapping out some of this Bunny Day stuff with uh, Halloween stuff. The thing I was kind of undecided on... Oh, this, <gasps> sure, what do you want? What's wrong? Hold on. I uh, spaced out and I bought a second cute floor lamp. I don't know what to do. I mean, it's not like I'm going to be using two of these things at once. Fuck yeah, I would love one of them. Um, but I've been kind of undecided because... Um, Something I saw in a dream island that I really liked is that they would have like all the different seasons kind of have their own sectioned off area of the island. So it's not like, you know, you have like a spring stuff area and then like a summer area and like a like a fall area and stuff like that. So I'm considering doing that. Like I'm considering um, just picking a spot and dedicating it to Halloween stuff. But for now, 
Uh, I kind of want to just switch this with like, um, I don't know what Halloween recipes I have, but if I have like an arch, um, I do have a spooky arch. So I might swap this out for a spooky arch and then uh, like this fencing and stuff and these chairs swap it out for spooky stuff and just kind of go around and decorate like that. But then maybe when the season's over, I'll pick a spot and I'll keep all of the uh, things like there, you know? Um, what's up, Lucky, you bitch? I love you. Hey there, walking buddy. It's my second time running into you today. The first was in your dreams. Okay, yeah, yeah. What's Tasha up to? That and I want to do like my island chores really quick. I'm thinking I'm just going to play this for like an hour or two or like an hour and a half or something. Um, get out while you can. If I'd known you were stopping by, I'd have prepared something. It's fabulous. Fabulous. Isn't it a tad low key? Denim painter's pants. Go home. <laughs> Um, you know, they're not skinny, but these are kind of cute, I guess. They're kind of a bit more fall. Well, nah, I liked my, my puffy pants though. Um, yeah. So what else we got here? Um, yeah, I'll do my island chores maybe. Like I tend to go around punch all my rocks, look for Gulliver slash recipes on the beach. Um, you know, that stuff. Talk to everybody. Check the shops. Recipe. Do the newer psychological horror games? Gotten pretty good. That's kind of what Kitty Horror Show is. Um, Kitty Horror Show does these like um, lo-fi, like they look like PS1 games kind of, and like they kind of resemble DOS games, and she does these like really they're more like conceptual art pieces almost you know in a weird way and um they're very impressive there's some really cool um uh jacob geller has a couple really good videos about her um so i that's kind of what i want to go into yeah um dear faraway reader i cannot stop thinking about this furniture i saw in a dream so i've turned it into a diy recipe now i find myself compelled to share this recipe with others if you would uh it would please me if you made it oh god damn it it's not a fucking seasonal recipe um what's up bug fuck you um yeah i watched um i'm thinking of ending things um it was a lot <laughs> i had kind of the same reaction to that movie as i did the very first time i watched mulholland drive um which was bewilderment and uh mixed emotions like i kind of was like it, it got me it gripped me it had me, and then it lost me at some point. And by the end, I was like, okay, that sure was a movie. Um, and I was just kind of like, hmm, maybe it'll take longer to sink in to like understand what I just uh, absorbed and experienced. And uh, it proceeded to do that. And now, like as it's had time to like marinate in my head, like I like I just was like, oh, oh. Oh, fuck. And then I just, like, could not stop thinking about it the whole night. Um, and that's kind of what Mulholland Drive is to me. Like, I can barely make it through Mulholland Drive without crying anymore. It's still, like, it's, like, one of my all-time favorite movies. But the first time you watch it, you're just like, what the fuck? You know? Um, and I'm thinking of ending things was very much like that. I was very, like, okay, I see where they're going for, but I'm not sure if it, it hit that hard for me. But then, like, a few hours later, I was like, oh, fuck, this hit me like a goddamn truck. <laughs> like... Evening, you wretch. Sometimes I get a craving for falafel, and nothing else will do. Griff the Invisible. It's very sad and sweet. Uh, I will say this about... Ooh, 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 ooh. I will say this about... I'm thinking of ending things. It is billed as a horror movie, and I really, really cannot describe it as that. Um, it kind of... It's, it's horrifying, like, existentially, but there's only, like... <laughs> a little bit of horror elements in there you know like it's it's not very much of a horror movie um 
Incense, wait. Oh, I thought that's an incense butter. Um. Yeah. Um. But, uh, yeah, so I'm thinking of any things. It's very good. It's definitely got me on. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. The fuck? I picked up a lost item. I should probably try to reunite this with its owner. Investigate. A well-used, well-loved picture book. There are little broken bits of candy between the pages. Fuck! This could be Sherb, Lucky, Wade, or fucking Stitches. Like, there's no way of knowing whose is this. Because I have four lazy villagers. Guy who thinks he's an, a superhero. Okay. Um, I would explain the plot if I'm thinking of ending things. Uh, but I really don't think I can. Um... Especially not without, like, spoiling it heavily. Which, honestly, like... If that movie... Like, it's nice to go in blind and kind of, like, absorb everything, like, for the first time and all that. I almost think it would be better if it's spoiled already for you. Because it's... But it, it doesn't... Like, if you, got, if it, you happen to get it spoiled, then, like, it's just not that... Like, it, it's kind of like the rewatches are so much better... Um, than the initial watch that I don't think it would ruin it necessarily, you know? Because it's not gonna fully click the first time you see it. I don't think. Um, Louie, what's good? Yo, big stink! You working those legs? I'll be seeing you. Okay, so it's gotta be... Okay, Wade, Stitches, Lucky, or Sherb? Whomst, whomst could it be? I'm... Is it on a streaming service? Yeah, it's on Netflix. It's uh, by Charlie Kaufman, so it's the guy that made, um, he wrote Being John Malkovich and Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind and Adaptation, and then he made um, Synecdoche, New York, uh, which is something the Hunter's been trying to get me to watch, um, and now I'm 5,000% on board, um, even though I already was interested in seeing it, and then uh, Anomalisa, so uh, yeah. If you've seen any of those movies and like them, it's, uh, that kind of vibe. Hey, Stitches, where the fuck are you? Uh, I was gonna guess that this was Stitches, but if not, oh, hey. Oh, it's Big Stink. Guess what, Big Stink? I got something for you. You ready for this? It's my old microwave. Hope you like it. Thanks. Thanks, Lopez. Great. It's exactly what I needed. Uh, yeah, where's Stitches? If I don't find Stitches, I'm just going to give this to Wade. Uh, and hope it's correct. It doesn't really matter much. The only difference is, like, you get one bonus point of, like, relationship points if, like, you, uh, if you guess whose it is. Go home! What's up, Big Stink? Great weather today, huh? Huh? I did? Nope, this isn't mine. Sherbs! Ah, that little twink. I should have known. All right. Yeah. On days where like I have more time, I also try to make it a, a chore of um, shaking all of the trees, which I'm probably not gonna do on stream because that's uh, you know a lot of time. <laughs> but I saw Sherb earlier, didn't didn't we? Yeah. Gonna read some uh, SCP or Creepypasta to the stream? That could be fun. I could do a dramatic reading. I almost headbutted the fuck out of Renee. Just smacked her snout. Squished her face in like an accordion. That'd been fucking brutal. Pretty weird that this uh, island doesn't have a hospital anywhere. Um, 
Oh, that could be fun. I could do some uh, SCP, like just some creepy pasta reading. What if you did like dramatic reenactments? That'd be fun. I've thought about that, like doing like theater streams, you know, like uh, doing. Okay. Ooh, is that a? That might be a big, big fish. <laughs> All right, where the fuck is Sherb? He was out here, right? Because I talked to him. He was he was stanking, and he gave me a dang lamp. So where'd he go? Is Lopez? Is he at my house? Uh, but I've thought of that, like, uh, doing, like, fully, like, acting out a part, you know, like, and, because I feel like people don't really do that. I mean, there's the philosophy to, like, Shakespeare stream from, like, two years ago, but that's uh, Shakespeare and not cool. Um, still wild that she did that for, like, 24 hours, though, uh, but... I don't know. I, I feel like there's a lot of potential with uh, streaming that hasn't been actualized that much. A tig tone monologue. I don't know if my fucking throat can handle that. I actually, you know, if I like practice, I'm so like rusty on like metal vocal technique, which I don't know if you knew this, but the uh, the voice actor for tig tone is a uh, death metal vocalist, which uh, absolutely shows. Um, and uh, his band's kind of fucking sick. It's very like Mr. Bungle-esque. It's like an avant-garde, like death metal. So it's like death metal, but very like, it'll just be like jazz and then like polka and then like whatever. It's just wacky and kooky and fun and very experimental. Uh, he's in a, he was in a couple bands. Like uh, I think one of them was uh, Sleepy Time Gorilla Exhibit is the one I remember, but he was in like two other bands that are also pretty fucking good. One of them's like kind of industrial. But Tigtone is fucking stupid underrated. That show rules. Where the fuck did Sherb go? Sherb. Yeah, what the fuck? His name, he has a weird ass name. I don't remember what his name is. Um. I swear to God, if I don't find... Sh oh, hey. Hey, this man seems like it's coming out of nowhere. Do you want to buy my apron? Sure. I don't want it, but I'll buy it. I will give you all of the money, Sherb. I would die for you. In fact, I've been looking for you so that I could die for you. I hope you enjoyed as much as I thought I was gonna. Okay. <laughs> nope. Is something up? I haven't been paying attention. You drop this? <sighs> what is it? What is it? What is it? <sighs> Autograph cards? I don't think I've seen one of these before. Anyways, bud, thanks for the apron. Um, I'll make great use of it. Let me see what this uh, autograph cards looks like. I don't think I've seen this. Oh, I'm, it must go on the wall. Oh, I know what it is. I know what it is. You can do some fun custom designs with that. Oh, hold on. fuck was I saying? Oh yeah, I can do some fun customizations with the uh, autograph cards, I believe. Um, let me go, um, okay. First of all, well, before they close, I'm gonna check out the stores. <laughs> I 
I am so mad that I spilt this. I got a seat. Oh, I should probably be checking my turnip prices. I haven't been doing that because um, I'm fucking wealthy. I'm fucking so wealthy. I don't need to. But um, Nick has been trying to get money in this game. If I remember right. Hey, do you know, um, so Nintendo announced that there was going to be an Animal Crossing Direct. Do we know when that is going to be? Damn it. Because, uh, I don't know, maybe I could stream a reaction to it or something. I don't know. Either either way, I'm just, I'm just pretty fucking excited. Um, this game needs some stuff. Watch them, though. Like, watch it just be the Brewster update or whatever. And they dedicate the entire direct just to Brewster and like nothing else. Like, and they make this big fuss just to do like one thing. Ooh. Okay, frame rate, let, come through. Let's go. <laughs> I had a thought. I want to try this. I should give my uh, little Animal Crossing guy psoriasis. <laughs> like, do a custom psoriasis pattern. <laughs> I mean, that's why I gave him the blush stickers. I gave him the blush stickers for my psoriasis. Um, so what do you got here? <laughs> I've been looking for a woman worthy of that name. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? I do like the park addresses. Those are fun. Honestly, I just look so fucking good all the time. It's so crazy. Like, I have the most swag of anybody playing Animal Crossing, probably. Okay, now I do. I think I already have a beak. I'm just going to buy one because I can. <laughs> yeah, give me that beak, baby. Just in October. They think they're Beyonce. <laughs> They're just gonna drop it without warning, just like, BAM! Nintendo went live! Oops. I wanted to keep this up for lighting. I was also thinking of, uh, I've mentioned this before on stream, I think, but I've been thinking of getting, like, uh, proper lighting stuff, you know? What's up, Louie? Hey, a thought? Working up a good sweat? A log, extra long sofa, outdoors? That's like outdoors squared. I don't follow, but keep doing you. I'm sure whatever you said was very profound. Ooh, I gotta water me pumpkins. everyone's vibing tonight. Hope we're vibing, because I'm going to fuck those vibes up by the time we get to Kitty Horror Show in Silent Hill 2. You know? Okay. Um, I'm going to go around and try to talk to everybody. What's up, Fuchsia? What's poppin', bitch? What's popping? Uh, uh, oh, she's cooking. Sup, Rambler? Need me for something? What you doing? What am I doing? Hyacinth lamp. Oh. This is a great recipe, but I already have it. This is the one that took me so fucking long to get for no reason. I have to find her something thought. This will be good for the giveaway. This is a popular recipe. Um. Uh, 
Who else do I need to talk to? I've talked to Lopez. God damn it. Maybe they will um, allow you to say no to recipes you already have in the update, finally. Jinx, you owe me some carrot juice. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Suppose if I had to categorize myself as a musical artist, I'd say I'm mostly into mariachi. Go off. But I'm also really well known in Zydeco circles. There's even a book that was basically based on me. Well, it's not entirely based on a true story. More like inspired by a fever dream. And I guess if you're going to be all literal about it, it's more of a pamphlet, really. Okay, so there's... Talk to Shoeb. Still haven't seen stitches anywhere. I swear to God, if they're in the museum, they're just gonna. I'm just gonna leave them. Your favorite horror character is the one that lives in your mirror. The one like right in front, or the one that like is always right behind you in the mirror. Cause I get tired of that cunt eavesdropping. My girl, we get it. Always some gray old bitch standing on my shoulder, glaring at me with empty black eyes. Like, sis, what do you want? You gonna make a call out for me or something? That I'm shitting with my pants all the way off? Like, what do you? Why are you in me? Why are you in my bathroom mirror, bitch? Like, girl. Um. Okay. Well, I. I can't find Apollo either. Where the fuck is everyone? Yeah. <laughs> Let me check in the uh, ca kiosk today too. Also, Lucky! Where the fuck is Lucky? We saw he was wearing my Joy Division shirt, but I haven't seen him. He was in the little title screen, but nowhere else. What do we got today? Trash. Uh, anything new? It would not seem so. I also hope for the fucking, um, thing they finally announced, like a, uh, uh, it's flick like amiibo or card or something cuz like I really want a poster of my good good boy my dummy thick twink boy I can add him to my uh, collection of uh, boyfriend posters around my room and in, in the game I swear to God, if they're in the museum, I'm not looking for them. But you know, you can do. You can do. Just that I just want to make sure. If you just save and exit and then restart, that'll like fucking respawn everybody about. Which is, which is great because sometimes I don't know how many of these bugs are still in the game, but every once in a while you'd get a, a villager like soft locked somewhere and you're like just bugged out and like walking in place forever. Um, and it's nice to have a way to reset them. <coughs> Yeah. And Dakota, have you ever played Silent Hill? Eh. Or seen the movie, I guess. Oh, he took the Joy Division shirt off. I don't even want to play anymore. No, we did talk to Lucky, right? He ran up to me on the beach or something? I don't know. My brain is made of pudding. Okay. Now where are you, hookers? Tasha we talked to. Is she wearing my shirt? Fuck yeah! Two thirds of the movie. It's like one of the only good video game movies, like video game adaptations, and it's like not the best, but I do enjoy it. 
I do think it kind of misses uh, the pool. I don't know. I would say it misses the point of the character of Harry for sure. And like some of the changes they made are just very confusing. They're stitches. Um, but the first three games, um, maybe I haven't played the fourth one, uh, but the first three games are masterpieces. <gasps> My other shirt. Look at how good he looks. Look at him. Hey, Big Stink the Bucks said they heard you walking this way. Now you're here. Yay. Did you happen to notice a really good smell the other day? Cause I sure did. You want to know what that means? It was a great big cherry that Wade was eating. Smell me so hungry. I took some trees and got myself a whole bunch of cherries. I don't know how many cherries I ate, but now all my burps taste like cherries. It's the best. Call out the old Costco hot dog. Um, but yeah, the first three Silent Hill games, for sure, like masterpieces. Um, Silent Hill 2 in particular, I think is a masterpiece of environmental storytelling. And I don't like to use the word masterpiece very lightly. Um, and I can very confidently call them masterpieces. Um, but yeah, Silent Hill 2 is just, uh, I don't know. It's not something you see, like the, the things that that game does are not things that you see often. And to, except for now in like the psychological horror, like indie game scene. Now they're starting to get, you know, take some of those like ideas and themes and work with them. Ah! <laughs> What's up, Sean? Great weather today, huh? Just think about a story grandma told me, but I forget how it goes. Once upon a time. Uh, oh yeah, it was her slipper. And the prince, prince figured out who she was because it smelled like her feet. Damn, the prince is a freak. Oh, the prince was a dog. Did I say that? That's why the smell part was important. But then everyone was happy. That's the end. Horror porn parody of Silent Hill. Honestly, the nurses are kind of bad, though. Like... Pyramid Head is kind of caked up a little bit, you know? I really love how Silent Hill, they keep bringing back Pyramid Head and just making him sexier. Like, there's no narrative reason to keep Pyramid Head around. Uh, they just, like, he's just popular and they just keep making him sexy and it's really funny to me. But it's funny, the, um... Like, I, I haven't seen any porn parodies in particular. Oh, there's Apollo. What's up? Night's just getting started. <laughs> God damn right. Uh, after a walk, I like to throw back a nice beet juice, you hag. Let's get one together sometime. And kiss. Please. Uh, yeah, horror porn is a wild rabbit hole. But I love, like, cartoony horror porn. I love when they just, like, sexy Jason Voorhees or, like... Uh, the scream mask guy, ghost face with a huge dick. I love that stuff. That's awesome. Um, I in the Silent Hill porn parody, were the nurses moving around and dan dancing like Lady Gaga the whole time? Because if not, then they're hacks. I think that's everybody. Did I talk to everybody? Renee, Fuchsia, Louis Wade, sure. Uh, Apollo. Yeah, that's everybody. Okay. So. Okay, do I have... Let me look at what recipes I have for fall. Um, is there a spooky fencing? There is. Lantern set. Now, if I recall, these function like... Uh, this also can function as like a bench, so... Um, I could have some fun here. Okay. Uh, so first off, what do I need for the spooky arch? 10 pumpkins, uh, 10 hardwood and three clay. I can do that. Um, What's funny is like a lot of the, uh, as I was saying, like the nurses being kind of bad though. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, is that like, um, actually, let me just see what spooky items I already have in my inventory. Cause I already made a couple of them last year. I did make a spooky tree. No, I bought the spooky tree. I did not make it. 
Um, ooh, I like this mom's plushie. But uh, the thing about it is you'll find in like Silent Hill 2, uh, if you are sticking around to watch me play it or if you play it for yourself, um, anything that is like weirdly sexualized is there to like serve like a narrative theme in a way that's really, really neat. Because we love some nurse baddies with some like gross, goopy gray skin. <laughs> And I do not have any spooky fencing. I kind of, I don't know if I want to do spooky fencing because uh, the bunny day fencing is just like the eggs. Like that's what I have over there right now. And I kind of want to just have that, but like pumpkins. So I kind of, instead of doing like fencing, I kind of want to um, do um, like just a bunch of pumpkin related items. Until they were riding. Oh, cowards. What? Oh, I forgot to grab pumpkins. Right. The thing that I need. Oh, pumpkins. I have so many. Oh my god. I, I'm still growing out my pumpkin patch and I'm just now realizing like, fuck, I really, I already have too fucking many. A link if you want. <laughs> Not on stream. <laughs> I'll watch it with some lads. Oh, microwave. Get in storage. Um, everyone's giving me... Hold on, let me see what this lamp looks like. Oh, that's a fun color. I don't have use for it here, though. But you know what? I feel like this room could possibly use a nice pop of red, you know? A nice red central piece. Anyway. Uh, I saw the message. I didn't open it though. Um, I was going to check it out later because I saw it was an Android store link um, and I am on iOS. Oh wait, did I just put away the fucking... I did. Put away the spooky arch that I just made so that I could do exactly what I'm trying to do here. Spooky arch. Oh, it's a wait sausage fighting game. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. I might have to look into that then. Okay. Hey, yep. I might keep the cherry blossom lanterns though. We'll see if I want to replace those. Let's -a go. Would that does it look good in this direction or would it look better if I did it like this? Whoops. Um, I like this one better. Okay, so Okay, so I'm gonna take some of these spooky chairs. Oh, I know why I have these here. It was because of an area. Okay, let me just grab some of my spooky stuff and also dunk some of my uh, rather random stuff in my inventory right now. Um. Anything spooky in here? This stuff. Um, we'll see about the spooky candy sets. Oh, wait, I need to... Whatever! Um, yeah, my inventory's gonna be full. I won't be able to do anything again. Uh -huh. I'll put my candy in storage. I don't need all this wood anymore. Don't need these stones. 
I'll worry about crafting stuff later. Play the Kingdom Hearts games at all? Uh, they're on my list, actually. My friend Nick just bought me a copy a while ago, and I'm just kind of waiting to play it. I might stream it. Oh shit, Louie, what do you want? What's wrong, bud? Oh no, I got in a big argument with Fuchsia. I guess I was being stubborn, and the competitor in me didn't want to back down. I got a gift to make amends, but, well, even a big tough guy like me can get nervous, you know? Oh, he's so adorable. Yeah, I'll give it to her for you, bud. Coming to Switch? Oh, cool. No, I uh, I do want to play him. I did see the Smash thing that uh, they added Sora to Smash finally. That's pretty cool. Wait, are they talking? Huh. It's a neat outfit. What's up, Thought? Oh, you're here again, Thought. Oh, <laughs> uh, I hope in that update, they're not gonna do this, but I hope they finally let you upgrade your villagers' houses. Cause like, absolutely try it on, bitch. Well, if you say so, I guess that's what we're doing. Turn around for a second, we'll find out. Hell yeah, I mean, it's, not a great color for her, but fuck yeah, I don't care. It looks gay. Oh my god, means well. Thanks for playing Peacemaker for me and Louie. I figured you might want to work with jacket. Y'all. At least that's the best thing I could think of. And thinking's what counts, thought. So the reason, oh, they materialized this bench out of nowhere, congrats. Oh, thanks for delivering that present to Fuchsia. Did Fuchsia say anything? Come to think of it. Really, I'm glad that I was able to fix things thanks to you, Big Stink. Thought! <laughs> okay, so the reason I had those, uh, the spooky table and chairs was because of this over here. Which, I could, okay. Because I swapped this stone table out for um, the spooky set, but I kind of don't. Arranging that mug with the face on it uh, was a bit of a pain in the ass. I don't know if I want to. Fuck it. All right. Uh, spooky chair. <laughs> Spooky table. Spooky table. Mm. No. No. You know what though? Okay, hold on. I'm trying to remember how exact. I'm gonna keep the bup mug there. Oh, I see how I did it. So I had to like, okay. If I go like this and place it. There we go. And then I will replace the other stuff with uh, spooky decorations. Damn it. And 
and I don't have any of the candy sets or anything right now. But, so, works in, mom's pen stand, I'll put those back. Spooky lantern set. Where you watched a Republican speech for true horror. <laughs> the whole stream of horror is just like staring at like Dick Cheney's skull. Nah, that doesn't fit there. Oh, yeah, I'll leave the uh, Blossom Lanterns because I just fucking love these guys. Look at them. They're so cool. Uh, so this, I will... Yep. Does it not fit? How big is this? Hold on. Is that... Oh, it's this one. Okay. I was thinking it was the uh, standing lamp. That's the one I was looking for. No wonder it didn't fit. Okay. And that's a... Uh, okay, so that's a... Sp is there a difference between a regular scarecrow and a spooky scarecrow? Scarecrow. Spooky lantern set. Spooky scarecrow. What's what's the difference here? I see. I feel like I should be green. Mayhaps. I'll do that. And I might swap this fence out for a spooky set fence as well. Wait. Oh, I need to get green pumpkins to do that, so I do have to go home. grab some of each color and see which one looks the best for this guy. I think it's already yellow. I think it's yellow, not orange, but we'll see. Fucking damn it. God damn it. Oh, wait, no. Wrong one. Okay. Spooky Scarecrow. So, we got... Orange, yellow, green, white. <gasps> I like the monochrome, actually. I'm going to do the monochrome. Let me just fuck around with these other things I got here. What, do, what, do, what all do I have? Like a spooky tree. Oh, the monochrome looks so good. It looks like the Cap Kingdom, kind of, you know? from uh, Odyssey. Uh, green or monochrome? I'll do... Yeah, I'll do monochrome for this one and then I'll find another spot for a green tree. Oh, I have two spooky scarecrows. Oh. orange and then for another one of those I'll do a uh, like I do, like I'll, I'll, I'll alternate the colors on those ones also maybe for other Animal Crossing streams I kind of want to tour some uh, like Halloween or horror themed um, dream islands That bitch, she looks so good. Henny. Hi, Apollo. Um. So yeah, here's the kind of thing I was thinking of. Like, um, 
So right, uh, whoops. First of all, well, I guess I don't really, I was gonna take a photo reference for when I'm done here so I can put it back, but. Ah, oh, fuck off. Um, but I just have my streams for reference, so I don't really need to do that. But I did it anyway. I can never make up my mind on anything. Lantern set. See, like here, I was gonna just put these like lanterns and stuff everywhere. That was my idea. And I might, um, hold on. Bunny day fence, yeah. So let me cop some of these. As the kids might say. I think this would be a good spot for like those stacked pumpkins. Do I have one of those? I got a standing lamp, a tree. Um, the tree I was gonna replace uh, this one over here, but my inventory's full, so I'm gonna go put my stuff away. any of those pumpkin stacks carriage I can find a place for that this can go on those tables in the uh, or that spooky table by Wade's house I need I can make a spooky tower right now and what do I need I need why do I need pumpkins for a fucking fence come on spooky lantern So I need iron, and I also need iron to make a spooky trick lamp. I kind of want to see what that is. So let me just cop some iron. I like my mess of a house. I don't know how many of these I need. I'll do like two of them, so that's 20, that should be enough. Maybe. I think it's 20 something for those, uh, fucking, <sighs> the wooden fences. I was gonna just replace the wooden fence with the spooky fence for now. It says I've made one of those before, but when? 
Oh, uh, you know, I probably just made it just so that I could have the spooky wand. That's probably it. back out. It was the yellow ones. Just in case I want to customize something. In fact, let me look at that really quick. Let me look at the customization options for all that stuff. <gasps> Ooh, these are fun. That we've already looked at. Monochrome one is just so fun. I love it. Spooky trick lamp. And what do we got here? Oh, it opens up and there's little guys in there. <gasps> wow. I like this one. These are so fun. I gotta have like at least like one of every color of all of these things in the candy set. So this is going between Wade's and Sherb's house. So I feel like I should color them accordingly. This is very sure, or Wade and Stitch's house, sorry. So this, I'm gonna do it this color. Cause that fits their aesthetics, I feel like. Yeah, I'm gonna need a little bit more than 20, huh? Whack! Damn it. Seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. That could work. Could just have it go out to like here. see that. Okay, let me just finish this up. It or, I mean, if I make another one of these, it'll give me 10. Which, like, if, I, if I'm gonna do that, I might as well just replace the whole fence, actually. So, yeah, let me do that.
some uh... can you okay hold on uh... can I place something on top of this that would fit <laughs> thinking another spooky stack there or I'll just move this one Oh, somebody's got fleas. That's what that is. It's tower. Mmm. It's Tasha. I can see him. Damn it. Fuck. I, I know. Got him. Yuck. I had fleas. My social status is going to plummet. Unless, <laughs> unless, um, thank you for getting rid of them. <laughs> Perhaps you can refrain from telling anyone go home. Bye. I like the idea of just releasing it and then just jumps right back on her. <laughs> oh, I should grab these. What other? Okay, let me just. I wonder what other um, spooky recipes there are. You know, like, is there one that could more resemble like a row of pumpkins? You know, kind of like how this the um, the bunny day fence is that row of eggs. You know. If I just place the pumpkins next to each other, they're gonna be too spaced out. It won't look like um, it won't look like a uh, fence or a barrier. It'll just be some pumpkins sitting there. It'll be awkward. Spooky. Is there something else I was gonna put here? Spooky trick lamp. What's shit? <laughs> if I <sighs> fuck it, there we go. Nope. Damn it. 
Does that... Does that work? Yeah, let's go. You know what? Okay, let me move this butt mug. Damn it. Damn it! <laughs> I hate it. I hate this game. what I'm going to do. Are you serious? It's because I have the fucking flowers now, don't I? Or you know what? I could place that on there too. No. No, I'm not. I'm, I can't because here's what I'm going to do. this over here and then candy set here there we go that looks way better okay and this flower can um, I'd say just go fuck itself Just find a spot for it. Spooky table setting is the other thing. I've, what what does this look like? Mm. I'll do that over here. And I'll just like make another one or something. Assuming that I can. I need clay, god damn it. Well, I could cop some really quick. Salted caramel Oreos? That's a thing? Bro, the one time I actually want clay and it doesn't spawn. I hate it here. I hate it here! <laughs> um... Fucking, uh... Here, Apollo, you want a flower? Oops. Ain't you lively. Oh, right, he has to be standing for me to give him a fucking flower. Here, you want a flower? Here, take it off my fucking hands. Why haven't I given Apollo more of those? That sounds so fucking good. <laughs> um, I just lost my train of thought in this game. It was the spooky. I needed clay. That's what I was doing. Getting clay for the. Uh... <laughs> I'm sorry, you just said Oreos, and my brain just shut down. Oh, I hear it. 
I see it. I see the shadow. Come here, bitch. Oh. Maybe this will have clay in it, actually. Blue ones tend to have clay. Piss off. Come on. There we go. There we go. don't remember which one I already have over there. It's the orange one. He doesn't know what to do. Give me a second here. I'll come help you, Paulo. the blood red. That's fun. It's like Sin City. There we go. You know, I could do all four of them instead of these little spaghettes. Okay, Apollo, what did you want? Where'd you go? There he is. Oh, hey, Platinum, maybe you can answer me this. Uh, you see, I already had a safety. I'm a motherfucker. I don't... Uh, I don't want your fucking... Uh. Thanks, Apollo. You're gonna throw it in the other pile of... You know what? Fuck. I'm not even going to give this one away. Who wants a fucking safety helmet? You're going in the garbage can. <laughs> I already had it selected. This game new. Bye, bitch. Okay, so what else... I feel like actually this should be a different color than the orange because it's right next to the orange. No, wrong one. I'll do green. Funny if the villagers started picking the stuff on the ground and tried giving it to you. I would be so mad. <laughs> that would be really good though. Like that that should be a mechanic, but it's not. I liked Desi's idea of this game, just uh it's just the same, but like the animals or like the villagers are just always like hurting themselves and you have to stop them. So, like they're just like 
doing dumb, dangerous shit, like fucking like I don't know, like doing like home improvement stuff, but just like standing on like rickety ass ladders with like both of their hands full of stuff and you just have to stop them from dying. Like happy tree friends meets Animal Crossing. I still think that was a really funny idea. Now the spooky tree is too big to fit here. I'll just do a spooky standing lamp there. You can't really see it, but whatever. <sighs> like, do you see my issue here? Do you see what I'm talking about where it just doesn't look f filled enough? There's it's, the, the gaps between things are too spacious. Of course, I could just say fuck it and like do that instead. Maybe like let me let me do this. Oh, what did I get? Ah, rocks. If I just like push this like over here, then I like. Just space them out instead. Just give up on trying to make it function like that. Actually, I kind of like that. Where is it? I hear it. I hear it. There it is. My ears, after playing this game for like almost two years, are so fine-tuned to this fucking balloon sound. I can hear it from so far away, like instantly. Come on. There we go. What do we got? Upright bag. Oh, great. Um... Pinterest fever dream. I mean, what? How? That is how pretty much I would describe my island, honestly. Like, is this not a Pinterest fever dream? <laughs> maze. Oh, a maze of decor. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> what else could a spooky lantern maybe? I want to change the color of it. Oh yeah, I know. It's 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 eight o'clock. Cr fucking cry about it, game. I just looked at where the webcam used to be. Um, let me see here. Spooky lantern. Oh, I don't have enough white pumpkins at the moment. Oof, unfortunate. I'll tell you what else I'm gonna do though, real quick. Spooky tree. Just get it out here. Yeah, look at it. Looks so good. Which direction? These kind of almost look the same. Yeah, whatever. I'll just do that. Some more white pumpkins. <laughs> Pinterest fever dream is my aunt's personality. That and the crazy Christian thing. Uh, there, the word for that is actually uh, chuggy, and it's uh, a fairly new invention of a word, and it's like one of the funniest words I've ever heard in my life. I love it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 
Let me see. It's like C H E U G Y, I think. Chugi. It also kind of describes my mom's house to a T now. It's really funny because they've been doing a lot of renova renovations there. And uh, my mom is very like, they're like, there's multiple picture frames that have live, laugh, love printed on them in that font. And I love it. What was I looking for here? Uh, oh, right. I was going to. Look and see, what do I need to do? Another one of these guys? It's pumpkins and weeds. Got it. Weeds. Fuck off! So hey, welcome if you've just joined. I've noticed the viewer count went up to a whopping five. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm gonna do just like a little bit more decorating and I'm, I'm gonna try to move on to, um... Wait, what am I... Not what I meant to do. Uh, lantern set? That's the one. Um, there. Chugi, I love it. Uh, but I, I want to move on soon-ish because I know Nick has to get to bed and I, he wanted to be around for uh, Kitty Horror Show. Um, so let me see how much longer I can, or how much more I have to decorate. And maybe on like Saturday I'll do like a longer Animal Crossing stream and do like that giveaway stuff, you know? Uh, Why did I make that? Oh, right. Okay, so let me... Huh. <laughs> nope, not that. Move! Unfortunate. This guy over. I'll do. Hmm. There. We go. You know what? This isn't that. Actually, this doesn't look bad. I I wasn't sure how I was feeling about it, but I kind of like it. And then. No, I'm gonna do that lantern on this one. There we go. Yeah, that looks better than I thought it would. Where's a good spot for this big carriage? Um, you know, okay, hold on. I'm not putting it in the fucking plaza game. No! It's too big. OK. 
Okay. Maybe if I dug up these flowers, I could put it in here. find a spot for those flowers. Oh, damn it. Fuck it. Move. Um, okay. Could definitely put it, like, over here. Maybe. Ugh, it's so big. It's very Shrek. You know, it looks like the thing that they go in, in, in Shrek. That's what it reminds me of. You know what? Okay. I think I am gonna... I'll just... Okay. What? I hear something? Oh, shit. Hold on. Make room. Yeah. Go home. Go home? Go home! Have you ever had one of those days when suddenly... When something you say all the time suddenly doesn't sound quite right. Yeah. <laughs> like calling myself a cis man. Yes, I know. Uh, I was thinking I should try to come up with a clever new way of saying for myself. What do you think? Yeah, it was an onion carriage. You're right. Uh, should I? I really like go home. Should I change her? Should I change her catchphrase? Should I change go home to something? I think it's fine the way it is, personally. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna give you some time to answer that. Wait. Shit, there's a balloon. Hurry. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it. I could, uh, at some point, at some point I'll change somebody's catchphrase to Chugi, I think, cause that'd be funny. That'd be funny, haha. <laughs> Where was that bitch? I heard it. I hear it. Where the f- Ah, oh, there it is. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Damn it! Okay, so yeah, I think I'm gonna scoop up some of these flowers, put a carriage here, and then that will be the end of this stream, and I will switch over and do the dang other game. Look at sure, look at Stitches and his little clutch. That's not a clutch. That's a that's a bag. But um, okay, let me put this other stuff away in my inventory. Keep that. I think I'll just need like these spots. Right, something like that. I'm wondering if I, I hope I don't have all the spooky furniture set already though. Like, cause like, um, Generally, the game during seasonal events tries to bias to like giving you uh, the seasonal items, you know, and if the balloons are already going back to like giving me chunks of iron instead of recipes, then it might be like already too late or, you know, I might are it might it might indicate that I already have all of them. Let's go.
Is that good or should I move it? And then for these flowers, I'll find a beach to put them on. these flowers I'll throw away I just don't want to throw away the pink ones because they're hybrids carriage down moving the flowers those are done I'm just wondering what other spooky stuff I can uh, have around what does this look like if I place it tiny teeny tiny And one more thing I'm thinking of doing. Let me look at, um, where's the dang catalog? Custom. Um, okay. floor tiles and I want to see if those um, flower like the colorful flower ones that I have um, I'm thinking of replacing those with like a um, uh, like a fall leaves color pattern because I imagine there's a ton of those now if we look in here like already we got a couple here I like these uh, this little chocolate ones that's fun Oh, sidewalk chalk. I like it. Oh my god. Jay, did you do this? <laughs> oh, I like this little puddle. That's funny. I like it. Oh, another one. Um, oh, these are neat. Hold on. I kind of want to favorite this. I'll come back to this later. Mm 
Oh, uh, hell, let's go. Hmm. Maybe I can make one at some point. Maybe I'll do that on another Animal Crossing stream, too. But yeah, there's always so many. Like, the. Ooh, this is a fucking gorgeous brick path. Oh my goodness. Lily from Oblivion. Navo motif. How is that Navo? Pumpkin path. Oh, that could be cute. <gasps> Ooh, fur floor. These are. <gasps> oh, that looks really good. Let's favorite that too. I'll have to take a look at each of these, like. Don't take. <laughs> Do not download this. Oh, this is a fun road. This is a fun path, too. That'd be good for uh, one of those uh, you dang kid core islands, you know? Oh, these are gorgeous. Oh, my God. People, the, the pixel art that people have made with this is, like, so fucking gorgeous, you know? Like... Like this, like, oh my God, look at this beautiful pixel art. Um, yeah, I think I'll do the rest of this another time. I think for now I will call this good. Um, I am going to go, uh, take a quick break. Use the restroom. Um, and then I'll be back and I'll get started on Kitty Horror Show. Um, I'll talk to Nick and see if we should do Haunted Cities 4 or if we should do Anatomy. Um, we'll see you later. Um, yeah, hang tight. I will be back. Um, just a minute here. Um... All right, and all right, uh, so yeah, I'll see you in a bit, um, yeah.